guys, Sharper back once again with another minting box for TokyoToysStore.com And today I'm going to be looking at the Rider Kicks Legendary Rider figure for Common Rider Greece. Now, Kazumi Sawatari is the leader of the Hokuto Advance Force, I believe. That like he invaded builds side of the country because reasons I forget builds pot confused me sometimes and yeah he was basically one of the major first common rider adversaries build fought because I don't think blood stark counts and yeah he made a pretty big impression because this form lasted almost until the end of the show. Like he he did it. He he took his weird goofy almost horrible base form design and took it all the way to the end and only in his like last appearance got an upgrade and it's basically this. <laughs> oh, Casamin. You did it, mate. You, you went all the way, and fair play to you. We yeah, standard box for Common Rider Grease. Not a lot to say. So let's take a look at the figure itself. And here is Grease out of the packaging. And it's a really, really good representation of the suit from the show. I wasn't the biggest fan of this when it came out well when it appeared in the show and was kind of one of the contributing factors to me like leaving the show because I just didn't like this form I mean it's so gold and ostentatious and it's really a suit design that had to grow on me especially when I came back towards the end but yeah, now I kind of have an affinity towards it. It's it's one of those suit designs where, yeah, it's all right in the end. But yeah, it's very out there. So you've got the um, not Sclash Sclash Driver. I should know this. I reviewed it. Picked out in like baby blue pink. Which kind of works, I guess, against the gold and the black. He's got a lot of tech gubbins on his legs, like warning signs and whatnot. His shoulder pauldrons have got like this Caprison design and the uh, robot jelly icon. And this whole crystallized grease liquid thing is kind of cool like it's very different and I think that's what kind of won me over in the end that it's such a unique design I mean Cross C had his version and it was awful I think but this is pretty cool. Articulation wise you have the standard amount of articulation which can be found in most of these figures which is great. Even his pauldrons swing around because these can act like jet boosters in the show. So you put some like that and you just go and the head's got a decent range of motion too. And like all the others in the RKF line, he does come with a bunch of accessories, including some swappable hands. Like this kind of come hither motion. Or it could be. Oh, I can't. 
If you could reach his cheek, it'd be a cheek scratch, but yeah, it's... Or it's good. No, I want it by Monday Jenkins. But no, it's basically to do that. And he can grip his own driver, which is cool. He also has a regular old fist because he's kind of the opposite number of Crossy. So he's going to spend a lot of time punching him. And because he's the opposite of Crossy, he also has a weapon that is shared with Crossy Ice. What is Ryoga's second form called? I forget. But yeah, he gets this pile bunker weapon. And here's a little secret from me. I love pile bunkers as a weapon. They are my favourite kind of weapon. Just big industrial spike and just go boom, boom. Love a pile bunker, me. But unfortunately, it doesn't hold, doesn't sit well in his hands. Like the uh, handle is a little too thick. Thick with two C's. And he just can't get it to sit in his hand comfortably or hold it well. So it ends up just flopping about, which is unfortunate tried it with both hands and it's just not holding so we're going to have to put him up here come sir and that's going to be about your lot overall Common Rider Grease is a fantastic addition to the RKF Lions ever expanding legendary rider series like yeah they've mainly focused on build so far but I really want to see more from this series and hopefully we will but yeah I think this is worth picking up if you are a build fan to get the main hero boys all together because I, I bet there's going to be a Kamen Rider Rogue coming down the line at some point and it'd be good to have all four of those boys together in a line and you can pick up Kamen Rider Grease from tokutoystore.com for $24.99 and I think that's a fair price. My name's Sharpo, this has been the RKF Common Rider Grease and I'll catch you guys next time on Mint in Box. <laughs>